This is the same type of thing we solved with Kramer's rule. This is just another way to do it. If you weren't good with matrices, this might be a little bit better for you. Okay, if you're bad at solving equations and matrices, well then you're really going to need this, but mm. can't have everything wrong. Okay, let's try another. 4x plus y equals 3, y equals x minus 2. Four x plus y equals three. Y equals x minus two. All right. So you can see again, the second equation is already in the form we want. It's y equals something. That's what we want. So I'm going to have to change y. We know that y equals x minus two. So I'm going to change y into x minus two. So still got four x plus x minus 2 equals 3. Okay. Notice, I only changed that one thing again in the top equation. Still got 4x, still got plus, still got equals 3. The only thing I changed here was the y. y became x minus 2. Alright, now, most of you probably like this problem though. Because as you notice, there's no number in front of the parentheses. Which means we do not have to do the distributive property in this one problem. So I can just erase the parentheses here, because they don't mean anything. And we can solve it from there. OK, so let's start with the x things. If I put 4x and x together, I get how many x's? 5x. 5x, good. 5x minus 2 equals 3. Okay, take a look at what we have on the board now. What do I need to move to the right side of the equal sign? The 2. The 2, how am I going to do that? Add. add it, good. I'm going to add 2 to each side. So I do that, and I get 5x equals 5. Divide each side by, you really can't screw this one up. Five. Five. And we get x equals one. Mm. All right, half the problem done. Half to go. Now, again, you've got to go back to your original two equations. So you can choose to work with this one. Or you can work with this one. Okay. Which equation do you want to work with? Again, both of them will get you the right answer. Alicia, which one do you want to work with? The top one or the bottom one? Bottom. Good choice. All right. So I'm going to change x into 1. So y equals 1 minus 2, which is 1. negative 1. So the answer here is 1. Negative 1. As you've probably guessed by now, I can't make this homework assignment too terribly long because these problems take a while. Alright, now let's example 3. Example 3 is a little bit different. You've got y equals 2x minus 6, y equals 4x plus 4. y equals 2x minus 6, y equals 4x plus 4. Okay. Now in this one, you can choose. That's what's nice about this one. I can take, since y equals 2x minus 6, I can change y here to 2x minus 6. Or, since y equals 4x plus 4, I can change that y to 4x plus 4 doesn't matter which one you choose. Okay. So let's just go ahead and say I'm going to take this and plug it in right there. So I've got 4x plus 4 
equals 2x minus 6. Okay. So let's start and let's shuffle things to the left side. So if I'm moving everything to the left, what do I have to move to the left side of the equal sign? Alicia? 2x. 2x has to move to the left side of the equal sign. So I've got to move this 2x. 2x is positive. Opposite of the positive is a negative, and negative looks like subtraction. So I'm subtracting 2x from both sides. So that gave me 2x. Okay. What do I need to do the Ollie shuffle to to bring to the right side now? It's got to move to the right side. I've got to move the 4, this 4, and I do that by subtracting it. And I do that, and I've got negative 6 minus 4, which is negative 10. Okay. So now it's a multiplication equation. How am I going to solve this one from here, Hunter? Divide. By? Two. two would be a good choice. So I'm dividing by two. That gives me x equals negative five. Okay. Got x. Now I'm going to find one. David. Which one do you want to plug x back into? The top equation or the bottom equation? The top? Top, fine, okay. So, we've got y equals 2x minus 6. But we learned that x is negative 5. So I'm going to change x into negative 5. So I've got 2 times negative 5, that's negative 10, thank you. And I've got negative 10 minus 6, which is negative 16. 16. There you go. Negative 5, negative 16. 